Hi, Shafkatal is here with another quick productivity tool for Google Technologies. Today, we're going to show you how you can automatically include the travel time of your Google Calendar events. You know, whenever somebody um, asks you to have an appointment, the best practice is don't take much time to put in a calendar straight away whenever you get the confirmation from uh, anybody you can just create the event for example i've been given the opportunity to train someone in the school on nine o'clock on a monday so i just go there open my google calendar calendar.google.com i just put there and simply i'm going to utilize my training session right there so i'm saving some time for the topping and then there's no one else going going myself but um, if i want i can add somebody who is a host there but at the moment focus is to show you how you can calculate the travel time including a calendar automatically so i'm going to liverpool public school here we go i found it public school that's it and just save it to keep the tutorial simple, I'm not putting a lot of detail, which I normally do, the instructions and other things, what to take if I have to. Now, the trick part is, which I want to show it to you, is to, once you see your calendar event is being saved, you click on um, the event and go to the address part. When you click on it, this magic thing will happen on to the right side, which I want to show you you get the detail about the location but you are interested into directions so that's the thing we want you to look at it when you click on directions this you see um, it gives you similar um, interface like you get in a mobile and you already indicated by the event that you want to arrive by nine o'clock and then you choose a starting point because you i'm not using mobile so it cannot get um, the location automatically all right so i'm gonna input um, the my practice address so i just put this one there and magic 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 it i calculate my travel time based on the average time on that time of the day so if you put a different time it might give you different calculation and it'll showing you you're going by motorway you say five minutes if you're going with a mix of saving toll and other thing you be spending more time there and also if you're a public transport person you can also use that but the magic part i want to show it to you once you give the starting point you can get this information directly to your mobile are you the main thing in here i want to show you to add this to your calendar you can get a detail of the um your trip but i'm interested into i want to save time it's a monday morning peak time i'm going by motorway i want to save some um, time by paying toll money once i do that it create another event for me automatically i just close this by the way this e calendar i use it for training purpose so that's why it's all empty so so it automatically add that into it and what does it do it add drive from this to this and use all those things in there in description so that's a great way to include because whenever we plan some uh, event i think we always forget about the travel time now this will remind me okay you need to leave by 8 10 to reach there by nine o'clock Thank you very much. This might save you a few minutes or maybe sometime you won't be late uh, from your appointment as well. Hope to see you with another um, great productivity tip from Google Technology. If you have any question, concern, please do ask. And if you have better thing to share, please do so in the comments. Otherwise, see you with the next tip another day, another device. Bye.